tracking several systems. One will bring us in light snow shower activity tomorrow. The other potentially heavy snow on our Friday. A lot to cover. We'll just go in chronological order here. We're starting out very cold this morning. Dangerously cold. Only one degree in Hot Springs. It feels like negative 20 when you factor in the wind. 10 in Blacksburg. 17 Danville today will be very much like yesterday. Breezy cold but with lots of sunshine. Temperatures only reaching the 20s and 30s this afternoon. Looking ahead to Wednesday. We start dry but those clouds fill in quickly into the afternoon especially after about 2. Those snow showers start to push in to our higher elevations and then continue to the east as we head into the evening and into the overnight hours. The snow showers tomorrow are going to be light. They are going to be scattered. We're only expecting about a dusting to an inch if you see anything at all. Very similar to what we saw on our Sunday morning. But looking ahead to Friday, we could see several inches of snow, rain, and even a little bit of ice as possible. Now I'm going to show you a couple of models. These are two different scenarios. This is not guaranteed. These are just two things that could happen. Now first, the European model. Model. We have a perfect setup for a heavy snow event. High pressure to the north, low pressure to the south. The low pressure system brings in moisture. We have lots of cold air already locked into place as that low moves in. It is a slow moving system. If the European model um, ends up doing exactly what it says it will do right now, we could get anywhere between 15 inches in Danville to 36 inches in Hot Springs. Still too early to really nail down a forecast. This is just taking you into what we are looking at right now before we make our forecast. The GFS track, high pressure, low pressure, similar position but slightly different track for that low pressure system. It will bring in slightly warmer air and it's also going to move through a little quicker. So that means less snow for us. Still a lot though. Up to three inches in Danville right now, up to 17 inches in Hot Springs. Both of these systems are bringing us a lot of snowfall. So if we get the 12 versus the 30, we're still going to have to prepare in a similar way. You would likely have those road closings all of the above. Now looking ahead temperature wise, we go from the 20s today into the 30s tomorrow. And then after that big snow system starts to move out of here, we will warm up pretty quickly into our Sunday and Monday. So it looks like we could see a lot of that snowfall melting. Now I stress to you, we do not have our area by area accumulation forecast just yet. We are going to prepare that for you today and into tomorrow, so I will have that for you tomorrow morning. Aaron.